Okay, so I don't know how many of you guys know who Ali Abdal is, but I decided to create a plugin based on one of his more popular effects. Now, the plugin is going to be completely free. I will show you guys how to acquire it later on in the video. But let's go through what it actually is or what it does. Well, you guys should have seen it on screen right now what it does. But I'm going to walk you guys through exactly how to do it. Right now, I have two um lines here. Where the two things here. They are actually both technically video files. But this works just the same with image files as well, okay? Now, unlike all my other plugins, this is actually a effect. So we go to effects, we go down to I technically, in this case, we go to glow picture in row. That's what I decided to name it. We would drag it on over and then we'll see the magic happen if you look over here it then it's effect now we are going to make this a little bit more blurry just by applying a regular blur to it so we can see the effect a bit better you know so we can see that effect in action here and actually changing glow and whatnot so yeah that's uh premise of it right then and there but it's not just that simple we can do a lot of stuff with this okay we can i made sure to make it so you can change the width and the height if you want so say we want this to be a bigger width that's perfectly fine i'm gonna keep it like this though say we want it to be a uh, smaller or even bigger height that's fine as well and i know what you're thinking but isn't that too small now now you can barely and it's not even fully in frame anymore well i got you covered there too you can actually move the position of what it will capture so that is pretty cool. So we can centerize this a bit. We can also make it brighter if we want to. Like how we were complaining about the background before. We can just make it brighter. Now if we go back play it, you can see it clearly. The glow. But wait, there's more. Yes. <clears throat> we can change these, the left color and the right color. So, in order to keep the glow, what we want to do is ideally make, like, whatever color we want, say this, say, say we want blue, okay? We would want to make this the lightest version of blue that we can find and then make this the darker version without you know going too dark See, because the darker you go with it the more it's going to add that effect and then if we go here and actually play it we have that effect right then and there which i think is very cool personally i may be a bit biased but yeah we have that cool glow around effect as you can see as i'm scrubbing it i know what you're thinking isn't it a bit too slow got you covered there too you can change the glow speed now you can change it to whatever you want but i recommend not going above like five or eight personally but yeah as you can see glow it's going super fast there so 
Uh, you can play around with that as you see fit. And I know what you're thinking. Okay, is that all? There is one more thing, which is really just like a bonus that can work with it. If you go to transitions, transitions totally work with it, no trouble. So, okay, we're going over here, and then it just slowly, calmly transitions up, plays the animation like we want it to, and then goes away. Plain and simple. Now, I said I would show you guys how to get this, or rather tell you guys how to get this. And that is, there will be a link in the description below to my Gumroad. It's completely free. It will give an optional um, amount. You can put in any amount you want. It, um, put in zero if you want. I think I'll have it recommend some amount, but you can put in zero if you want. It's perfectly fine. And then just get it just like normal. You'll get the download. You install it like a typical plugin and it would show up under effects. So definitely keep that in mind. Coincidentally, it's my first effect plugin. I hope you guys do enjoy it. And with that said, I will catch you guys in the future. Later. Mm -hmm.